Hello everyone, this is Tamala, and I want to welcome you back again to Designing with Tamala Bowie Interiors. And if you're a new subscriber, welcome. And if you have not already subscribed to my YouTube channel, go ahead and hit that uh, subscribe button. Now, in this video today, I'm excited to be sharing with you the reveal of my master bedroom makeover. This has been a long process for me, but I'm so glad that it is finally completed and I can share with you guys. So now, without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into the live video of my master bedroom makeover. Okay guys, here's the reveal of my new Martin Lux master bedroom makeover. I am extremely happy with the outcome of my master bedroom. It turned out exactly how I envisioned. It was a long process because there was a lot of pieces that I wanted to bring inside of this space and I didn't want to compromise. So without further ado, let me go ahead and just take you on a brief tour. Now, if you guys remember um, my bed, this is the before picture of the bed. You remember I had asked you guys to help me solve a decorating dilemma if I should upgrade to one of those modern reupholstered or upholstered headboards or keep with my Ethan Allen solid wood bed. And the decision was to keep the bed. And I just stained it this dark, dark espresso color. I'm ex absolutely excited about how it turned out. So I actually got a new bed without having to pay a new price. So the bed turned out beautiful. I love the new dark color. It did give this bed now a more modern look and feel. So now let's go ahead and talk about these pillows and this comforter set. I, I decided to keep the white comforter set. I splurged on the sheets. I got these Greek uh, key sheets. Um, the flat sheet is embroidered with this black and white Greek key pattern as well as the pillowcases. The pillows are absolutely sumptuous and very colorful. These are the colors I'm using in this space. The black, the grays, the sapphire and royal blues with just a hint of purple. Okay guys, so now I wanted to do something unique on the wall behind my bed. So I decided to incorporate this graphic pattern on the wall behind the bed. And I also added these three silver metal architectural orbs just to mimic the graphic pattern that's on the wall. Now, I want you guys to comment below if you think this is wallpaper or not. And towards the end of the video, I will reveal exactly what my team and I did to this wall. So now this is my husband's nightstand and I decided to mix the metal. So I have a gold lamp base with a black drum shade lampshade and also we have his silver tissue box and this black horse and down there at the bottom that's just a white box that he keeps a lot of his little whatnots and actually guys this is not a nightstand this is actually a file cabinet that I am repurposing as a nightstand so being a designer we have to get real creative sometimes and I really couldn't find what I was looking for so I decided just to take a file cabinet and repurpose it into a nightstand and coming right up like I said right behind there oh you can see me right behind there is the mirror and like I said that mirror has a brush a uh, gold champagne um metallic finish to it and it's also trimmed in silver. Now this is my side of the bed and I did not choose a file cabinet. I wanted a desk because I want to be able to sit and write in my journal and look at some of my favorite design books and magazines. So I actually purchased the um, desk that matches the file cabinet and it works beautiful in the space. It fits perfectly and I love it. Right over here I use this particular lamp it matches with the other lamp except it's different and it's okay to mix and match your lamps as long as they still flow in the same color and also with a matching lampshade. So this has a deer that's in gold and the lamp base is black and again there's that black drum shade. And also I have the matching mirror over here. Like I said it has a brush gold champagne um, metallic finish and is trimmed in silver. Now I've always wanted a fireplace in my bedroom and when we had the house built that was not something that we could add so I was excited when I found this fireplace. It actually was brown and again if you follow me on Instagram you have seen it before and I just painted it white and now it looks and blends in perfectly in my master bedroom. And up here 
like I said, I have my television mounted, which affords us the luxury of being able to watch television in bed. So now I want to talk about another area of my master bedroom. Okay, guys, so this is a newly created area in my home. I'm excited about this space. I used to have a tall armoire here. I removed it out of the space. I now have this beautiful picture that now sits above my settee yes i'm excited about this new settee this is another area in my master bedroom space where i can sit down enjoy and just relax in my master bedroom and i also added this brass lamp once again i'm mixing the metals the pillows flow with the other pillows on the bed and they stay in tune with the color story that's in this space and then i've added also these two gray leather footstools so i can relax in completeness without having to put my feet on top of this cream um, color set tees. Okay guys, now here's the new ceiling fan. Would you believe it took me three months just to find the perfect ceiling fan? And I was so excited when I found this fan. It's 52 inches in size and I love the espresso blades. I love the brushed nickel cage and the LED lighting. So now this ceiling fan just finished off the space perfectly. Okay guys, now did you not enjoy that? My husband and I, we are really enjoying our new master bedroom makeover. It's very relaxing and calming, luxurious, sumptuous, modern, almost every adjective I can think of, that's what my master bedroom is. Now, if you watch the video all the way through, I asked if you thought if that was wallpaper on the wall behind my bed. Well, it's actually a stencil. It took my team and I about four days to do that wall because I have very tall ceilings in the space. So I'm glad I created that stencil wall behind my bed because it added some character to the space. Now, comment below what part of my master bedroom makeover that you like the most. And also, if you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel and you want to get more great design videos coming your way, then please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And once again, thanks for watching Designing with Tamala Bowie Interiors, designing for how you really live in your home. Bye for now.